I'm redoing this video because um, the last one was very noisy and kind of distracting um, but I'm going to show you how to put a JPEG file and be able to cut with it. You come over here where it says upload images and you click on this. You'll have two options. You will pick the one right here, upload image, then you go to browse. I happen to have mine right here and I'm going to pick this file which is conveniently there. Once it shows up, you then hit simple image. You wait for this check mark to turn green before you can move on. It is now turned green, so you come down here and you click continue. Your file is very large, so I'll go over here in the right hand corner and minimize it down or make it less here. Then you come over here to the left and take your wand and you will click on your project now to clean it up. We'll have to be patient. Um, sometimes it takes a little bit to start working. And here we go. So, as you can see, it took the background out. Now you have to go into all the centers. And you have to make sure you don't miss any of these little bad boys. But if you do, you can always hit back and uh, get what you notice that you missed. I'm going to pause while I clean this up so you don't have to sit and wait. I now have it all cleaned up. Once that's all cleaned up and you're finished, you come over here to the bottom right and you click continue. <clears throat> You'll notice over here it says save as a print then cut image. Do not use that. You come over to this one where it says save as a cut image. You click on this. Sometimes it takes a little bit for it to. Sorry for the focus. Does that sometimes with my phone? But you'll come over here and click and um, it takes a little bit. I'm going to pause. Oh, well, there it goes. Um, I recommend over here it automatically puts whatever the name of the file is and it says together is our favorite place to be. But you put little special tags so if you um, want to search for a particular um, file that you have when you go into <clears throat> insert images you can um, type in certain tags that you came up with to help you find it I always use for my signs word art sign signs love favorite things like that um, and you can come up with as many as you want but um, that that'll help you find um, where it's at later you hit save down here in the right hand corner after you've done that right now it's saving My computer needs to restart it. <laughs> I will pause so you don't have to. Once it's done thinking, it'll take you straight to this page. And this is where all your uploaded images library is. Um, since this is the most recent one, you click on this to retrieve it you come over here and you click on insert images now we are on design space and here is the image and at this point you can make it any size that you would like it to be 
you can stretch it out there's an unlock if say you wanted it to come this way a little bit that will look really weird because it looks stretched but anyway um, so that's how you do it I really hope this helps and it was not so distracting for people it was quite noisy because my family was up and about so hope this helps <laughs>